And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Lucian Fury. Gonna bring this deck back. This was a deck that we played uh, one time a, l a little bit before the uh, patch 1.2 changes. And uh, it, it was really good before. And so I wanna try it again with, with, you know, after the new patch, it's a good aggressive deck, um, you know, that's basically Demacia you know, with, but with Lucian and Senna, but then splashing Freljord for getting another really good one drop with Omenhawk. And then we have, uh, also with with Freljord, we get Sejuani at the top end, which was incredible. I remember Sejuani looked really, really good, just being Overwhelm, and of course the Vulnerable and everything, but yeah, finishing the games out with just a huge Overwhelm threat. And then we have uh, two other things. We have Babbling Bjerg, Draw a card with five plus power. So we're putting this in the four mana slot where we always draw Scythria or Sejuani. And so that we're always having turn six, we get Scythria and Sejuani, which are super powerful finishers on turn six. So we always have those. And then we also have a really good pump spell with Fury of the North being a four mana, given ally plus four, plus four this round. Great pump spell to finish out games too. We're making one change. We're taking out Loyal Badger Bear. We're playing Laurent Protégé instead. Instead of playing a 3-4, we're going to play a 2-4 Challenger. <clears throat> but we're going to keep Grizzled Ranger in here. Grizzled, Grizzled Ranger is still awesome. Um, uh, but then, yeah. This this deck played Laurent Duelist, which was pretty impressive last time. I like really like this card. It's just a pretty sweet deck. So let's play some Lucian Fury. and we're The Fury is from Fury of the North. Not Battle Fury. Here we go. We're going to go play five games over in Ranked. Alright, and then yeah, we hit that. We just hit that sub goal, so I will... Change that on... On Twitch. So yeah, now we've hit nine out of ten sub goals towards a ten hour stream. Okay, let's see. Fiora Shen. I'm actually going to mulligan Grizzled Ranger and keep Fury of the North. So this is the kind of thing that if we were... If they had the attack token turn one... I would be playing Tracker turn one and then Bright Steel Protector at turn two to challenge. We don't have the attack token turn one, so we'll start with the Omen Hawk. Um, my my upload speed with my internet's been really good. My download speed for my internet, is, I don't know why, but it's been it's been poor. Like I'm. I'm paying for gigabyte internet. Um, <clears throat> and, you know, so it's supposed to be like, you know, 930 megabytes or something like that. But I always, I'm getting like, over the last few months, I've just been getting like 20 gigabyte or 20 megabytes, not 930 like I'm paying for. I don't know, I guess I need to contact them. But the upload speed's been good. No, no problem streaming. Um, so that's been really good. Alright, so they played Key Guardian last turn, so they got a barrier on something in their hand. We don't know what that something is. This is the board that's like the loudest. I don't know why this me board music is louder than all the rest of them. These woods protect their own. I can turn down the board music. For this level. Sentinels of light don't fear the dark. Back. 
it's the mo router modem. The the router modem is like the ones that they they issued. I have really nice router modem, like modem plus router, that I bought in December. That was a couple hundred dollars. But uh, you know, whenever they installed this and, and talking to them about it, they said it wouldn't make a difference. Yeah, like using using theirs or using mine. The Fury of the North. They are furious. Well, I really wanted to play the Laurent Duelist this turn also, of course. Honor guide me. Missed your chance to run. Burn away the shadows. Yeah, we're gonna do Vladimir Swain right after this. Oh, yeah, I should have attacked with Lucian before Senna. Yeah, that's a mistake on my part. Because... And I've talked about this before with these two. That, that was just a, a mistake on my part. Because, like, with this kind of deck, if they're going to kill one, they want to kill... They want to kill Lucian, not kill Senna. And so you should attack with Lucian first. Um, so that if they do kill Lucian, then you have the double strike Senna. So you kind of punish them for doing that. Yeah, that was just a mistake on my part. I know it'd be really good to ha to play these this turn also. Like, what's the worst that they're like? If I play Laurent Duelist, what's the worst that they're gonna do? I don't know. Like, so is this lethal? So let's see. They block here, here. No, I mean that's only seven damage. But then both of their things die. I'm gonna play the duelist. Block here, block here. They're taking four plus five is nine. And then I fury the north. Good. All right, GGs. We survive. Victory. Why not? Got 
to get that XP. Yep, could use it on Shen. I thought it was just easier to use it on the 3-2, because then they, you know, couldn't even single combat and kill the 3-2. They already couldn't single combat kill the Shen, or the Sejuani. Sorry. I think I said Shen, but yeah, could use it on Sejuani. So, Zero, what's your deck about? Mount with Maokai Heimerdinger. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was... I was probably going to be doing, like, the, the single player with Monster Train a bunch. I yeah, I don't know. Matthew was just, just introduced me to the game Monster Train. That looks pretty sweet. It's like a new Slay the Spire. Which is also an awesome game. Who does not know the name Laurent? I was worried about them having Thermogenic Beam to kill Lucian, but I think it's still the play force them to have that card. Up there in the mountains. Four things for Ezreal. Start for him. I wish I could have Cythria plus Fury of the North, but I can't. The, they could still kill my Cythria. So let's play the 6-6 six, six, one. If they, if they use Thermogenic Beam, it's going to kill either 1, 6, or 7. If they use, like, Will of Ionia, I'd rather them bounce the 6 than the 7. And Cousin Palm. Wow, that was a good turn for them. Got a whole bunch of Ezreal targets, too. Ouch. I 
So they pass the turn. Do I even play Cythria? Or do I just go straight to combat and attack for 9? The problem with playing Sith, like I play Sithria, they thermogenic beam my seven seven, then I'm going straight to not straight to combat anyway. There is only two uh, thermogenic beams left in their deck. I really hope they don't have that card. Please don't have th thermogenic beam. Okay, so that's not as bad. Well, the reason why they're gonna, you said they're going to thermogenic beam anyway, might as well be now. The reason why it may not be now is because I'd want to have Fury of the North Soldier, to, me. to protect. Maybe they'll use Thermogenic Beam right now on my Laurent Protégé. <laughs> gotcha. Why would you do three damage to a six six? That doesn't make much sense. Unless they have another three damage. Right on. They did not. Awesome. All right, we are 2-0. Fury of the North has been looking real good, both of these games. It's been a great uh, trick against removal both times. Last last game was a single combat. This game, that gotcha. Vladimir Sejuani. All right, let's get rid of the fours. I don't really need to start this either. I want to, you know, we want to start early. We want to get our ones and everything out. Let's, let's just mulligan all those. Okay, see, I like this. I like Tracker into Warchefs. Uh, I don't really know a, a good Vile Maw deck. I would recommend going to Mobilitics. Mobilitics? I'm, I'm trying to learn how to say the, the, this name. Mobilitic. Mobilitics. Um, anyway, it's this side that I have that I have uh, all my deck lists on. If you just click over there, if you go to the deck library, you can search. You know. Um, You know, change it to be last updated instead of hot, and you can search for um, vile maw decks and see if there's anything there that piques your interest. Mobilitics. <laughs> they don't 
So this game feels like jank versus jank with MTG. <laughs> can see that titanium. Yeah, this game's great. Okay. So I think we... We have two options. You know, of like what we want to kill. I think I kill this thing. Then they can block my war shafts, but my war shaft stays alive. Here. I don't really like my hand. Ranger, Ranger, Bjerg. Would have loved the old hand, old Grizzled Ranger. I mean, still even new Grizzled Ranger. It's probably still going to be pretty good. Beard will go grab us, Sejuani or Cythria. I did not want them to have. Well, now obviously we're not going to play Grizzled Ranger. Spend my whole turn just spending two mana. We'll spend the four mana and get the double attack in on the Grizzled Ranger instead. <laughs> Dogs don't like the, the recycling people around now. They're down here. Uh, let's see. Move this. There's Harvey. There's Harvey and Puppy, they're, they're both there. This is Harvey, she's just looking real attentively out the window. Everyone bleeds for the right prize. Trash people were here like an hour ago, and now the people picking up recycling. Attack! Playing Swain Sejuani climbing up ultra fast. Nice. Yeah, I'm planning on playing that on Sunday. We're gonna play um, Swain Sejuani Sunday and Endure Spiders Sunday, and then I, I'm not sure what our other decks will be, but I know those will be two of them. We should play a control deck. We have not doing any control today. Should probably play some control. Take it. Don't block. You want your Imperial Demolitionist to die? Ember Maiden. <laughs> so defiant. Alright, Illuminati says, I'm about to hit you with the spiciest donation deck. 
I am ready. Oh, and you meant to say overgrown snap vine? No, wow, mom, yeah, there you go. Yeah, you can still use that. It's a, it's a good resource. Pain is nothing. I can do that too. It's nothing personal. Yeah, Mobilytics is the is the League of Legends. It started League of Legends, you know, but they have Legends of Runeterra section of their website as well. So epic. Hey, Scrub Lord. Not lethal. Wield your fury. Wield your fury. All right, now lethal. You know. Lucian of Fury. Fury's been good. Just smashes. Plus four, plus four. It's so big. So big. I think Sejuani is amazing. I think it's a it's a really good card. I think it's one of the better champions. And definitely. Probably like the most underrated champion still right now. I think Sejuani is awesome. A lot of different Sejuani decks I really like. Um, this hand is just kind of awkward. I don't know. This. Let's see. So this matchup, we need to be fast. We have. All right, cool. We got Tracker, War Chefs. You think the Sejuani Vulnerable should be permanent? That would make it better. Mm. Why do we keep drawing the six drops? Doesn't help. Help. Hey, Alex. Set the hooks. So I basically had to decide which one to trade with the three drop, either my my two one. Everywhere. 
Alright, four drop. Alright, I'll take it. Protect our grove. That Maokai is kind of perfect. And honestly, this this Wanderer is also kind of perfect with this lifesteal. It's kind of perfect. We'll have another Fury of the North after we play Sejuani. Dang. That's a really good card to have, too. If I play Scythria, then this this 2 1 doesn't get to block their other. Like, they make another 2 1. Like, those 2 1s don't get to block. I mean, they get to block Scythria, I guess. But I can't really kill Maokai. If I play this, we can kill Maokai. So I guess we play this. Not over though. Not over yet. Soldiers to me. Probably is over now. Bring me chaos.
me, coward! So I'm planning on Fury of the North Sejuani, of course. Yeah, they probably have another, that's what I was thinking too, another Devourer. They are just passing. If I play Grizzled Ranger, then, then they have free reign to play all sorts of other stuff. Maybe I just pass back. I'll let them use that 8 mana. I still have, you know, Protege plus Cythria this turn. It's possible they're trying to, they just want to Atrocity and they want me to tap under single combat. Why is that a card? Seriously, like, why is this a card? Yeah, yeah. It's completely unnecessary. even have to have <laughs> okay so five mana you get three five fives that's a that's incredible why do they need to have deep and why do they need to have fearsome also like why can't they just be three five fives for five that's still ridiculously good you just have to make them eight eights with fearsome it's just silly oh well all right so we're three and one Mulliganing Senna against the removal heavy deck, it's really easy to kill Senna for the mana cost. Keeping Grizzled Ranger, uh, because of course Grizzled Ranger can uh, be multiple bodies.
pass, do nothing. Yeah, might as well just pass. No, they almost ran out of time. So close. Almost. Let us settle this with great sensibility. They try to kill my badger bear, I can single combat. That get excited probably doesn't look so good now. Probably doesn't look so good now. I think I guess I'll let them decide. I'm gonna let them decide. If they wanna trade off at Ezreal for my 4 1, we'll do that. If they just wanna take all this damage, we'll do that too. Unfortunately, they had Will of Ionia. Ezreal is 4 out of 8. Maybe they're having connection issues. Looks like they're having connection issues or something. That's unfortunate. Bow to no one. Face me, the Winter's Claw triumphs! Oh, I feel pretty good about us winning that game. Alright, so four and one. Lucian Fury took a great deep hand to beat us. I think this deck's really good. I think it's really solid. If you know, if you like Demacia stuff, you like Lucian Senna um, and everything, give this one a try. Like Fury of the North is awesome. Sejuani is awesome. Like these two cards are really, really good. And then you get just another good one drop with Omen Hawk to help you get ahead and everything. And yeah, whenever you Omen Hawk and get an additional 
um, plus one, plus one on like any of these turn two or turn three plays. It can be quite strong. Yeah, I did play this deck um, like five days ago before before the balance patch. I think we went 4-1 with it then as well. <clears throat> we made one change, though. We had Badger Bear last time. We took out Badger Bear for Protégé. I'd rather have a 2-4 Challenger than a 3-4, especially with more Twisted Fate, um, Black Market Merchant, all that kind of stuff in the format. I want this Challenger. But yeah, the Duelist has looked good. I'm glad we have, like, two Duelists in here. That card's looked good. You know, giving, like, um, Quick Attack cards, give them Challenger, that's nice. Um... You know, before we had Badger Bear to give Challenger, which was also nice. Um, but, you know, we just also have, like, some other things to give Challenger to. It's a pretty cool little card. Uh, question is, should I just mulligan for 1, 2, 3, 4 every matchup? Basically, yeah, especially the 1, 2. <clears throat> especially the 1, 2. That's the most important thing. And, and the 3 is not bad either. The 4 you don't really need. Like, mulligan to make sure you have, like, 1, 2, 3. You can mulligan away the fours. Yeah, you want to start. You want to start ahead. Hey, Candice. All right, so that's Lucian Fury. <clears throat> Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Um, you know, leave some comments. If you're playing this deck, let me know how it's going for you. Let me know what you think of Sejuani and Fury of the North in Demacia. All right, but anyway, thank you so much for watching Solution Fury, and I'll see you for the next video.